Hey guys, it's Samari and welcome back to another part of our Generations Let's Play series. So it's been a really long time since I've uploaded another part of this LP and I am so happy to finally be back into it. So yes, we are back with the Anderson family and in this part I really want the family to go on like a family vacation and I actually plan on Lucas and Callie getting engaged. So before we go, I do want Dallas to break things off with Valencia. As you guys know, we've been having problems with her and she's just honestly like not loyal. So let's just hop into the let's play. So yeah, you guys, I spent a little bit of time playing off camera, but not really um Callie and Easton are over here having a whole argument it looks like they're getting along better but yeah they really do not get along um Elena is waking up in the morning as well as you guys know they all um graduated high school so I really want them to you know get ready for college you know the quadruplets I really want to take them but yeah the family's just all chilling and all that jazz so I'm gonna go ahead and switch over to Dallas because he is about to break up with Valencia what is he doing he's practicing the school cheer so we is she home oh let me reset Valencia okay stop dancing Dallas Valencia's here oh my gosh this is gonna be kind of awkward um because we're like standing outside of our house okay let's see if we can ask to go inside um let's go ahead and greet her i don't know if it's gonna work or not okay valencia is finally inviting us into her house so let's see let's see um it's gonna be really awkward <laughs> we haven't seen her in a while but we're just gonna break up with her we don't really have much to talk about you know their relationship is really really low as well like look you guys look at how far back she's like they where is she there she is oh marlo oh marion no we're not gonna go on a date oh my gosh y'all here comes the dramatic part <laughs> he's about to break up with her i'm here for it though oh yikes she's like what did i do wrong like you know what you did oh she's upset she's like you gotta get out of my house <laughs> i am so sad for dallas though you guys know how much of a loyal person he was and yeah i'm really sad but i just feel like it's for the best you know he's he really wanted to marry her and like be with her in the long run oh he's so sad um but she's just not the one but you know he has been getting closer to this girl named sandy french so who knows they might end up becoming a thing but for now, Dallas is happy to be single and out of that really toxic relationship. But yes, we are heading back home. Um, I don't know what else we are going to do today. It is actually a spooky day, but I didn't plan anything for the family, if I'm being completely honest. So yeah, um, how about Dallas? You go ahead and let's see you can go ahead and let's play chess online he should work on his logic skill but yeah you guys um i don't know what else we're gonna do today i guess elena could call ryan i have been having the quadruplets plus cali work on their skills for um uni because they are probably gonna go to uni <laughs> um that's why i really want to wrap this up so we can you know go to the next stage i did end up giving ryan a makeover let's go ahead and chat with him i don't know if we will end up seeing him in this part but i do want her to chat with her man um pretty much talking about high school and their plans after graduating and you know i feel like ryan doesn't want her to go to uni but she wants to, you know, figure out what she wants to do with her life. You know, she loves fashion and art and stuff like that, but she's not exactly sure what she wants to do. And she just kind of wants to go to uni to explore that. And Ryan is not too sure about that. He's going to miss her. So, yeah. And then Chantel enjoying Oliver's music. I love this family. But, yeah, you guys, I am going to... um send the family off to vacation because i really want them to go 
so <laughs> i'm honestly so excited i think we're just gonna go ahead and go i have a custom world that i want them to go to so um let's go ahead and real estate and travel services let's go ahead and travel okie dokie we are going to go to um this place called Mar marinese reach i have trouble pronouncing it and the whole family's gonna come even sophia and we're just gonna be there for a couple days so yeah you guys we are going to head over there everyone is leaving yes um we are out of here i'm so ready but yeah you guys i guess i can just go ahead and skip to when we actually get to the island so yeah i will be back when we arrive there hey guys we are back at mariner's reach which is the island the family is vacationing on and it is super beautiful everyone is laying out at the beach we actually just arrived and they all just wanted to go to the beach some of them are starting to get hot though we might need to freaking go inside but yes elena you're getting hot yeah let's go ahead and get in the water i'm kind of scared but yeah some of them are laying out by the water um they are in some of them aren't even in a group like sophia girl <laughs> first of all this isn't even a swimsuit what are you wearing but she's she's not allowed to be in a group i guess because she's a child which is really annoying but um <laughs> she's still a part of the family anyways this is mariner's reach this is the little island i have done a, like a mini review on this world it's really small and it's super cute i love it for vacationing and i am using inras traveler to come here if you are wondering how i'm doing that but yes we are here and what is oliver doing he's literally just sitting here thinking about something cali girl you better get in your bikini and get in the water come on but yeah they are getting really hot out here i don't want anybody to burn to death oh <laughs> look at Chantel playing in the water she's so cute this reminds me of you know like when we first started i think the first episode she was playing in the water but yes everyone is having a good old time oh where's tristan at what is he doing i do want to disband this group though because i don't want it to be like uh, some people can't come with us i do want them to like go into the town and probably go to the nectary so i'm gonna have everyone like get out of the water and like stand out here so we can go they're also all wearing like winter outfits i just i didn't feel like changing everyone's outfits until something summery for vacation i'm sorry y'all oh look at all these boats jeez where are all y'all going <laughs> i hope i clicked everyone but yes um i didn't want to change everyone's outfit because it just would have taken too long not that i'm leaving sophia where's my girl sophia at she's literally just sitting right over here here i'm gonna have her teleport but yeah i think we're gonna go to the nectary um because it is time to try some nectar go inside go somewhere that's a little bit cooler they're all getting really hot and yeah but i definitely want the family or i mean lucas to propose to callie at some point in front of the whole family i just think that that would be so cute he's obviously a coward why is he so hairy lucas who told you to be so hairy but um <laughs> i need to fix that i don't know why whenever my sims age up they get super hairy but um yeah even though lucas is a coward and obviously like he's shy about that he is still going to be a man and do what he has to do which is propose to callie because he is freaking in love with her um i'm gonna go into cast real quick so i can fix his hairiness um because it's really annoying me but <laughs> right now we are heading over to the nectary look how pretty it looks like this world is really really nice it really is they are really enjoying their vacation all right this is the nectary or whatever we're just gonna chill out here for a while there's not a whole lot to do here besides like clubbing eating drinking but uh beach stuff like that so i'm gonna go ahead and have some of them try some nectar 
um yeah let's go ahead and taste some different nectar everybody taste some nectar um what is sophia doing oh sophia's all the way over here they really left my girl no bring sophia where where are y'all even at <laughs> Not Sophia being left behind. I'm gonna teleport her over here. That is so sad. But yes, Callie, you can also grab something to drink. Are you going to? Also, I changed Callie's outfit, kind of. I mean, it looks pretty much the same. Um, but yes. Harper, girl, you are not allowed to drink, girl. You are too young. <laughs> you are still a teenager, Harper. Please. But, um... I guess the family doesn't care because they're on vacation, you know. Some places you can be like 16 and drink, so I guess that is the excuse that we're going for right now. But everyone is drinking the nectar, and we'll probably go out to one of the clubs um, and have Lucas propose. I'm so ready. Once it gets a little later, though, because it's still kind of early, but yeah it looks like the family is having a good time i love them they got so much nectar they're literally going to get like lucas is already buzzed <laughs> boy if you don't stop screaming and yelling oh uh, what's wrong with dallas but yeah i really want the family to like bond and stuff so i'm going to have him um talk to his mom and um, gossip about his relationship. Oh no, why is he feeling nauseous? Oh, yikes. I don't know why. She's like, oh, I didn't realize they weren't that close. I thought her and Dallas were super close. They must have, like, lost their relationship as time went on because she has so many freaking kids. <laughs> but yes, let's go ahead and tell a funny story. And how is Easton doing? He's about to get some more juice. Also, um, I do think that I'm going to have Easton break up with Kari as well because I don't even know why he's in a relationship with her. Like, they're only dating because she asked him out at prom, but like, obviously, Easton is not going to be loyal to her. So, yeah, where did they get all this juice from? Look at how much they're drinking this family can drink but yeah there's actually like a strip of like different places to visit so um there is i really like this place next door the alfresco or whatever this place is really cool because it has like a pool area so i think this is where we are gonna go everybody just come over here um can we go here why can't we go here with our group i want everyone where is he going why is he why is oliver already home please oliver's like i do not want to be out in public with y'all anymore everybody go out to the club or whatever because callie's gonna get proposed to which i am here for yes everyone go next door y'all had your y'all wine and y'all nectar astonishing aroma Ooh, and the sun is starting to set so it's kind of like perfect timing but yes I'm going to go ahead and have Easton order um, a group serving of sushi. We're going to splurge a little bit because our family is really hungry. Um, and maybe he can order another thing too. But yes, everybody, how about all of y'all like swim here in the water? How about y'all do that? And you also swim. And even the, how about you get in? Everybody just get in the water and just relax because something's special is going to happen okay he ordered the sushi um Callie, Callie and Lucas seem to be getting a little close I mean yeah they can go on they can be on a date they are about to get engaged did she not give us our food ma'am we are trying to order something what is going on but yes everyone is getting in the water Harper is enjoying herself look at Tristan <laughs> <laughs> just shaking it i love that but yeah we definitely need to do this proposal y'all i'm so ready i am so ready i love how oliver just ordered food for himself jeez 
Okay, I'm gonna have him change into his um, swimwear. Let's go ahead and grab a plate of that. And let me go ahead and change his um, <laughs> hair because it's really bothering me. Okay, you guys, I finally freaking got rid of Lucas's body hair. But yes, look at the whole family. They're all dancing. <laughs> oh, I love them. So I feel like the whole family probably knows that Lucas is planning to it. Um, propose but obviously Callie doesn't know at all she has no clue but obviously like she's gonna say yes period um oh Callie why are you arguing with Dallas police girl here let's go ahead and swim oh my gosh I can't and I'm gonna have Sophia go ahead and grab a plate of food um I just want her to you know relax because she's acting a little crazy but let's go ahead and get out so that lucas can talk to us and pretty much propose to her and all that jazz Ooh, she's looking good okay let's go ahead and kiss her it's starting to get a little late too so it's gonna look super pretty out omg y'all we're really gonna get proposed to and you know what's really sweet is that, um, you know, they kind of started dating at the pool. Like, that's really where he asked her out. So, it's going to be perfect. So look at them. Aw, the vibes are immaculate. And the whole family's here. I love them so much. I really do. Okay, let's go ahead and can we, oh, we can't even do it yet. We have to like butter her up a little bit first. So let's go ahead and keep making her feel good <laughs> so we can finally get the courage to propose. Oh, we can do it now. Okay, perfect. I am so ready. The whole family's gonna w witness this beautiful engagement. <sighs> Like, who, how pretty is this to get married here? Oh, and look at the boat in the background. Okay, y'all, it's happening. OMG, y'all, he is proposing in front of the family. Oh, she's so excited. Oh, look, you guys, the whole family's watching in the background. That's so cute. She's like, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Aw, aw, Callie and Lucas are officially engaged, y'all. How sweet is that? Oh, not her crying. Aw, that is so perfect. I wonder how they feel about it. In the mood, ooh. She is in the mood. Well, yeah, the whole family just witnessed Lucas proposing to Callie, which is super sweet. Where is the boys' bathroom? Here, come over here and use the bathroom. This family has been low-key, like, bickering and fighting with each other <laughs> this entire trip. I think they're all, like, tired of each other. But anyways, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and um, finish up the rest of the trip off camera um because i just don't want this whole part to be extremely long so yeah i will catch you guys back when we are back in sunset valley but that was such a beautiful engagement and yes you guys i will see you guys when we get there okay you guys we are back home and as soon as um the family got back home elena freaking invited ryan over i guess she just missed him too much but yes they are just going to chill out here um also you guys i don't know if anyone has noticed but callie and Chantel have a terrible relationship they really dislike each other um but there's a lot of romance going on in the living room or in the foyer it's kind of awkward because Chantel's just standing there girl how about you go ahead and make something to eat but yes the couples are you know relaxing having a good time um it's freaking raining now i'm not sure who he's talking to oh dallas is chit-chatting with sandy so that's nice and oliver is staring into nothingness you know oliver how about you call up your boyfriend josh 
and see how he is doing so since there's a lot of love and relationships going on i do want um easton to stop by kari's place i don't think she's aged up yet she's still a teenager i think we should probably break things off with her though i know another breakup but you know easton he's never gonna be loyal to her so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and go over there. He does want to see his daughter as well because, you know, I'm not sure how old the baby is yet, but we do want to see our daughter. Um, but yes, Kari is still in high school. It's kind of awkward. You know, he is going to college soon and he also just isn't interested in being in a relationship. You know, he wants to be a master romancer. That's literally his lifetime wish. So yes, we are at Kari's house and we're going to break things off with her. Um, so yeah, it's going to be really sad. Um, not really though. <laughs> We all knew they weren't going to last at this point. Um, is nobody home? Here, let me reset everyone again. Okay, I reset the whole family. It looks like our baby girl is here as well. But let's see if we will be let inside of the house because we are trying to get in. Um, so yes, he wants to teach Lily to walk. Aww. Well, if Connor would put our child down, this is Connor, right? Oh no, that's freaking Hank Goddard. Goddard. I don't know why I thought that was Connor. Can he put her down? We want to see our child. Anyways, maybe we should talk to Callie. Can we, or not Callie, Kari. Let's go ahead and call her over. He's like, I need to talk to you. It looks like Hank is feeding the baby, which is super cute. Um, but yes. He's gonna have to break things off with her. Can I don't even know if we can. Um, okay, yeah, we're gonna have to break up. Oh my gosh. The breakups in this part are so dramatic. But, you know, we're kind of turning over a new leaf. Oh, she's like, what did I do? I just had your baby. Everything was going good. It's kind of hard to explain, girl, but... <laughs> We had to do it. Easton is behaving inappropriately. If he continues, he'll have to leave. Girl, calm down. Well, now he's about to take some of their food, so we'll see if we get kicked out for that. Okay, no, we're not getting kicked out for that. Looks like the family's having dinner, so he still has a really good relationship with Kari. I just don't think that they're meant to be together. They had a baby, and yeah, um, but he's going to eat dinner with the family. And I think we should also play with the baby. I think we should do that. So let's finish eating. And yes. Hey, Lucas, you have to have a bachelor party before you get married. Oh, yes. I don't, I kind of want to do a bachelor and bachelorette party. So that will be fun. Not Easton trying to clean up. Ooh, ooh. There's like fights going on. I can't. Easton, you are not cleaning up their house. You need to bond with your daughter. You know, he is family oriented. So, Sophia Anderson. Oh, Sophia's out past curfew. Girl, if you don't go home. Oh, look at Easton being a good father. I love her orange hair. Yes, toss her in the air. Tickle her. Can we not teach her to walk? I don't think we can. Aww they're so cute he is a good dad even though you know he got this girl pregnant in high school he's still a good father so i'm literally here for that oh look at them flirting i can't <laughs> i freaking can't i love them but yes i don't know i feel bad for kari maybe we should like talk to her oh we can teach her to drive what the heck Let's tell her a funny story. She might still be upset with us. I don't know. <laughs> I feel so bad. Are you still mad at us? Oh, we're showing her something. She's like, really? You're really showing me this after you're breaking up with me? Oh, yikes. Okay, yeah. I think it's time for Easton to go home. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yes, go home, Easton. That was a hot mess. Oh, my goodness. Um, let's see what Elena and Ryan are up to because he is still 
with us um let's go ahead and do a heat of the moment kiss he's literally just watching her slide and laughing oh it's hard to imagine that day going any better playful banter gave way into gazing into each other's eyes oh so he left but yes elena's heading to bed um if you guys didn't notice we aren't getting the quadruplets in their jobs yet because you know i want them to focus on building their skills for uni and stuff like that so that's pretty much what they will be doing um dallas is still going to be you know working as a police officer that's pretty much what he likes doing and that's not really going to change but the quadruplets are definitely going to um you know focus on their education because they are going to uni hopefully and girl what are you doing <laughs> look at harper she's like i gotta get fit like no girl oh i still love this house y'all so so much i really do this is like literally one of my favorite houses i've ever played in like ever it's so gorgeous um i just love this so much but yeah it just looks like the family is doing their thing a lot of them are listening to oliver out here um but yeah but yeah you guys this was a really interesting part i hope you all enjoyed it also make sure you check out my discord in my description i also have a twitch link and other social medias all linked in the description i hope to see you guys in the next one and i hope you all have an amazing day bye